Welcome back to the What's Cooking Show. Uh, just a reminder, we have Ms. Gail Dago with us today, and she's got uh, Dago's line of special sauces that are uh, in retail stores at this time, and she's making us a nice chicken dish. Ms. Gail, where are we at now? What's, what's our next step? Our next step is uh, put our onions, bell peppers, and a little bit of jalapeno in there. And okay. Then I'm going to go ahead and uh, add some sauce. All right, if you want to go ahead and add that, you can go ahead. If you're ready to, if not, it's up to you, whatever you want to do. It's smelling good, that's, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. It is. I'm going to go ahead and add a little sauce also. We have Daigle's Cajun Sweet and Sour Sauce. I'm going to add about a uh, half a cup. Yum. Yes. <laughs> It looks really, really good. I'm about to start tasting. I bet you with the, 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 the sauce and the, uh, the vegetables in it, that's really going to be a nice dish. Yeah, that's good. That's I'm going to just set. caramelize a little bit before I add my onions. Okay. And if there's any questions that our, our viewers might have for you, where can they reach you at, Ms. Gail? Uh, 337-298-7897. Okay. And if you want to listen to the sauces and everything, just go on your website, yes, which is? www.cajunsweetandsoursauce.com. Very good. Wow. That's yeah, good it's here. looking real nice now. Starting to caramelize a little mm -hmm. bit down there. Mm. Sauce is kind of getting a little thick, thicker. This is really, really good. I'm going to add a little onion there. I have a All right. one whole onion. I'm going to go ahead and chop a few. Uh, okay, we'll just grab it for you. <clears throat> kind of Bell. chunk them out a little bit. <coughs> Almost like a little stir fry. Mm -hmm. Except a, with a Cajun sauce instead of a, a, a soy type base. I'll right. go ahead and add my. Uh, green, red, and yellow bell pepper. And then I'll add uh, jalapeno in a little bit, the last. In the end. So far so good, it don't take long at all? No, sir. Mm -hmm. Very easy dish. And if you want, you can serve this over rice or some kind of pasta. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. You can incorporate the pasta while you're cooking at the end also. Mm. Some panay pasta. Or and some I'm, I think I'm gonna add a little bit more. Tea. Some panay. He likes panay. I love panay. Actually, Tell him why, Jason. because it doesn't get all over your face. <laughs> I never eat it. <laughs> you know, I, uh, one of my salesmen uh, told me yesterday there's a new, new type of pasta out. I can't even remember what he, what he called us. I've never heard of it. He said it's fairly new. And it's designed to, uh, it's a little swirl. And as it swirls, it comes up mm -hmm. a little bit. And um, I forget what he called it. And I think I might have it. It's designed to hold the sauce well. You know, on, a, on like a pasta dish, mm -hmm. you have a little sauce. So uh, it said something new, and they have it in stock. So I may get that this weekend. Oh. Just to try. Like I was there last something weekend. Something new. You sure were? I don't know. It was delicious. And it was I, We had a great, my mom, I've loved the fried crawfish. Come on, I love them too. And she don't eat crawfish hardly at all. She Come just, on. But. Just like some little popcorn crawfish. Mm -hmm. But you love them. <clears throat> so far, so good? So far, so good. Don't make a mistake with the jalapenos like I did when I was younger. Mm -hmm. I cut them open and de-seed them barehanded. And I did, oh. a, I did a bunch of them. So my hands Burn. were on fire. For a while. Yeah, Took you, a little while. You got to be careful with those peppers. But once, once it hit me, it hit me. And it hurt me. <laughs> I'm just going to add a little bit more. Uh, it's just going with that some good sauce. Yep. Looking really good, Ms. Gail. Uh, different sauces can be used for different things. I know you got like one that they, they used on the ribs and stuff. And yes, sir. Uh, real, actually, they're all rib sauces, but we don't market them all as rib sauces. Mm -hmm. Because you can use them as a dipping sauce. You can use them as a marinade. Multi-purpose. You can use them uh, as a finishing sauce for ribs, brisket. Grilling blend, applewood, jalapeno blend. Wing sauce. 
Wings habanero also. ribs also, but that's... Habanero ribs. Let's see, I'm a rib person. It's <clears throat> probably a little hot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Man, it's smelling so good in here today. It looks real good. Jason will be eating wonderful after mm -hmm. a while. That's why I forgot to bring forks. I keep forgetting to bring forks. Yeah, that's right. We're supposed to replenish our supplies. We've had so many great dishes over the time, and we, we, we enjoy Tuesday mornings <laughs> a lot. <laughs> we don't eat breakfast on Tuesday mornings. We enjoy doing the What's Cooking Show. Speaking about that, if you want to be a, a guest here on our show, you can contact the uh, office here at KBCG Station, and uh, anybody that answers the phone will be able to help you. Set up an appointment to have a, a show with us. Yep. Come by. It's free of charge. Just come in just put your name down. We or do it every Tuesday us. morning. You can email us as well. That's right. Email us, and you're Jason, and uh, we'll website. be glad to put you down on the schedule. We, uh, we do it every Tuesday morning at 9 o'clock, and... Uh, we try to, you know, get everybody here early to where we can get everything set up and all the cameras ready to roll. Because, uh, you know, everybody's on a on time limit, so we always every have minute fun. does count. So, yeah. But we always have fun doing the show. So, again, if you want to be on a guest on the show, just call the station or email us, and uh, we'll put you in there. And it's, it's just like cooking at home. You have to be nervous, yeah. no nothing. We just only have a couple of people in here, so it's no big That's deal. That's how I always explain to people. They ask me, you know, how it works, and it's just like cooking at the house, really. Except you get to a goofy old man uh, standing next to you. Let's <laughs> 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 say goofy, let's say funny. We're, we're funny. Funny, yeah. We're not good. I'm just going to go ahead and add the jalapeno in there. The heat. A little finishing touch. Well, I'm going to take a quick break, and we'll come back and uh, finish up our dish. Okay, sounds good. So join us back for more. Let's cook in just a couple of more minutes.